Hey girlies, welcome back. So today I have a styling video for you and it's specifically going to be me styling two new pairs of jeans that are now in my wardrobe. I bought both of these pairs of jeans. I believe I bought them on Black Friday because they were like 30 or 40% off and they are both a more expensive pair of jeans. So I could not pass up the deal. However, I haven't worn either pair. I haven't even tried on either pair for you. So we're going to try them both on today and I'm going to style each pair for you. So if you like a gold day and you like Pistola, be sure to give this video a thumbs up, consider subscribing, and let's get into it. Before I put the jeans on and style them for you, I'm just going to talk about each pair real quickly. And you can see tags are still on. This first pair is the Pistola brand. Pistola always seems to have this white tag on the back. These are the Lennon High Rise Cropped Boot. I'm going to have obviously both pairs linked down below for you. I'm going to have to see what retailers I can find them at um, because these brands are sold at multiple retailers. So I will link as many retailers as I can. These are specifically in Zuma. Zuma is the wash. They do have a frayed bottom and I picked these up in a size 25 so I did size down in these haven't put them on for a while so hopefully they're still gonna look good and then the next pair is by a gold day these are the Riley high rise straight crop and I already have these I believe it's called endless is the wash but obviously you can see this is a gray color and I also sized down in these to a 25 the color of these is called Century. And yeah, I have found with a gold day that I need ones that aren't very stretchy, which is weird. Usually I would like stretchy jeans, but their stretchy jeans end up being too big on my waist. And then they just I, they just don't fit me right. So I have found that the Riley, these have a little bit of distressing at the bottom, have a little bit of stretch, but not a lot. And if I size down, they fit me perfectly. So let's get these on and style them for you. All right, guys, so I'm going to have every outfit labeled by the numbers. So when you go to the description box, it'll be easier to shop each look if you want. So this is going to be outfit number one. I have on the Pistola jeans, obviously, because they are the blue denim. I love these. I haven't had them on since I bought them, like I said, on Black Friday. They are a little snug, like they are snug on my thighs, but I know that they're going to loosen up with time and I feel like they are so flattering from the front. They fit my waist perfectly, like I said, sizing down. So for my first look, I went really simple, but I feel like it's just the perfect look for right now. So this bodysuit, I just picked this up from Abercrombie. It was in my last haul. It's a very like thin, stretchy, ribbed bodysuit. It is scoop neck. You have to be careful with the bra through, showing through. I did size up in a medium to it because that's what I like for long sleeves. And then I have on my Abercrombie Broad Sleeve boots. I believe these are still available and they are true to size, but I love this look. I, I still have the tags on. I just... I keep tags on until I wear things. It's just how I do it. It doesn't mean I'm getting rid of them. And yeah, and then I was filming a reel, so sometimes I like to do the whole sunglasses thing. I got these sunglasses um, in Mount Dora from a boutique, so I don't think I could link them. I guess I could link the boutique, but I've been loving my, got like three pairs of sunglasses for $45. You cannot beat that, right? And then you I'm sharing like $200 pair of jeans, but love love these oh and I did look I found this exact pair in the Zuma on the Pistola website I didn't even realize of course there would be a Pistola website but then on Revolve they have the style but in different colors so those will all be linked for you I'll kind of link each jean and then we'll do outfits under underneath but all right that's the first look. Okay, so for outfit number two, I'm keeping on the same bodysuit because this is such a great piece that can go with so much. So I wanted to go ahead and style it with the other pair of jeans. So these are the gold day jeans. And I told you they are a crop, so you can see how they're cropped on me. I am 5'7 for reference. I always have 
my like normal sizes and my height and weight and all that in the description box below to help you girls um because i know sizing can be so difficult and again i size down in these to a 25 just better for my waist they are very snug again but i feel like they're flattering it's funny because there's the whole like skinny jeans are out skinny jeans might be coming back and um these aren't skinny but they're slim <laughs> But I don't care. I like that they're fitted um, and you have to wear what you like. And they are a little bit like at the bottom here. There's like some give there. So I think that's what makes them a slim versus a skinny. I went ahead and put on these slides. I've had these for quite a while in my closet. They're such a perfect go to little sandal um they are the brand vince camuto i get them from nordstrom and i do size down to an eight in them so if you have a narrow foot i recommend sizing down because your foot will slide through i also have them in pink which i'm gonna be honest i don't really wear wear the pink too often but i loved the bright color but these are great for so many outfits so here is outfit number two and I know you guys request a lot that you want like outfit ideas and that's how I am like when I go on Instagram um, I mean I love to see like ooh, that's cute to buy but I'm always looking for for outfit inspiration myself and I like save a lot of outfits on Instagram that it's like oh I kind of want to copy that or do my own take on that so I understand where you guys are like it's more outfits so um, and it's fun because now like it's fun for me <laughs> to think like ooh. I'm when Ron and I go out tonight, like which outfit that I'm putting together and I'm, am I gonna wear? Um, but okay, less blabbing and next outfit. Kind of a side note, but if you guys have never seen me share this plint roller or you just haven't bought it yet, I'm gonna link it down below because it is amazing. I actually have two. I keep one in like my work bags that I wouldn't have lint on me at work and then, and sometimes I'll throw it in my purse for the night. And then I keep one just in like my underwear drawer, but they are so good. I'm actually at the end, but then there's just little refill like this pops off and you put a new one on and then it closes. So great. <laughs> All right, but anyways, I'm gonna throw that over there. My next outfit, I still have the gray jeans on. I love a black and gray look. Like I just feel like this outfit is so hot. Like. There's just no better word to describe it. I feel like you're crooked. It might just be me. Um, this is Bodysuit from Abercrombie. I've had this quite a while. I don't think it's available, but as always, I will link things that are similar. You might just have a black bodysuit in your closet already. And then these are a pair of black suede boots that I have had for a long time. They have lasted so well. They are so comfortable. They're not comfortable to wear like shopping 10 hours at the mall. I learned that. Um, but they're comfortable for a night out for sure. And yeah, I just feel like this outfit is so cute. Obviously, if it's like cool out, I feel like a black blazer would be so sleek with this or just like a black coat. But I would definitely like keep with the black if I was gonna layer on top. All right, so I actually wanted to see what gray on gray would look like to kind of do like a monochromatic look. So instead of throwing black over, I still have the bodysuit on, I threw on this cropped gray sweater that I have and I feel like this looks so good together. I still kept on the black boots. Um, I feel like the monochromatic needs to end with the gray here and not go into the footwear. So I like a black footwear. And then obviously like these aren't the exact same gray, but I feel like this is really cute. So it's kind of like evolved into a second outfit or like it could just be a layer. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to see how it looked, liked it, so had to share. <laughs> Back to the Pistola pair, I wanted to tell you guys quickly, the Agolde pair is a button down fly and then the Pistola is a button and a zip. I just feel like people like to know that. Um, so for this next outfit, I put on a little cream mock neck. It's also ribbed. I could have left on or put back on the bodysuit. Um, as obviously it's the same color, but it's a different style, right? So a little bit more coverage up here. And then I switched out and put on these Mark Fisher booties. They're a little bit of a higher heel. Um, they fit a little bit differently. I've had these for so long. They're probably 
the booties that have been in my closet the longest and I just love them so much. They're so like broken in and comfy um, and they're always available. And if you get them normal price, they're $200, but they are worth it. You figure if I've had them four years, that's like $50 a year and I've worn them so many times. So if you figured out the cross cost per wear, it's just like a no brainer. And then I thought it would be cute to just add a little puffer vest. So this is from Amazon. I love this. So cute, right? Oh yeah, such a cozy, fun outfit. Now the good thing is, is that if you're watching this video and you don't want to buy these expensive jeans, I mean, you can copy these outfits with any jeans. It suggests that these are like a boot cut and then obviously those other ones are slim, but it's just kind of giving you ways to style these different styles. And if you guys want me to try any other jeans down below, or if you want me to try any other jeans, let me know down below. I obviously love Abercrombie. If you guys are just finding me now, I have like 40 something Abercrombie try-ons. I have pretty much tried every type of Abercrombie jean and I have my favorites and I continue to try them as they come out. Um, but then I like to have the more higher end denim as well. And then if you've seen any of my Levi videos, you know I've tried so many Levi jeans and I think I have one pair that I kept. Um, but I, and I do have some American Eagle jeans that I like also. Um, but that's, that's like pretty much it for jeans. I, I'm not really into buying jeans at Target or on Amazon or anything like that. Um, I have in the past and I just want better, better quality. And I feel like if you're watching this video, you probably do too. Um, but I'm always open to try some other brands. Like I've never tried the mother brand. You know, there's certain things I haven't tried. So let me know. All right, girls, we could not have a video without this pink sweater in it, right? You guys know this, the sweater has been popping up all over the place. I love it. Okay. So I threw it on, threw it on with the blue denim and the sneakers. Like how this is so cute. It's just like a comfy, casual, like I'm going to go out run errands. I'm going to go meet the girls for lunch, like whatever. This is so perfect. And I have said before, but this sweater is so darn comfortable. So comfortable. I hope it's still in stock for you. I know it came in tan too, if you're not loving this pink, but I'm loving this pink. And I kind of just like it out. I mean, I can mess around with tucking it, but no, I just like this comfy. And then I wanted you to see like how these jeans look with sneakers, with my Veja sneakers, like how cute, right? So like boots, sandals, sneakers, they just look so good. Also obsessed with this black jacket and I don't nearly get to wear it as much as I would like to because of my climate, but I just had to see how it would go with the look. And it's just as if it couldn't get cozier. Like this is so cozy, you guys. It's, it's been cool in Florida, but it's back to wear. Like it's probably 79 by now. There's no way I could wear this. Like maybe we'll get another cold front, but I wish I could because this is so comfy so comfy and I love it because it's like the jeans are fitted and then they flare out and everything else baggy but I feel like it still looks so cute. Of course now I had to see how the gray jeans look with sneakers so I've got the Vejas on with these also so cute. Love it. Like I love the cut of these jeans and I'm really not into like short cropped ankle jeans but something about these I just love them. And I knew that I did because I already had them in the other wash. I put the mock neck back on and I just put on my fleece belt bag, one of them the black one because I just feel like it's just that sporty, cute look. I wanted to give you guys a layering option with this look too. So I threw on this Abercrombie puffer. Abercrombie has a, such an assortment of puffers. They are so good. Even in Florida, you need them. I have found myself wearing this one so much this year, but just a cute little added like comfy piece. Hey right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I feel like I could style endless outfits, but I think you get the idea. Both pairs of jeans can be styled dressier. They can be styled casual. They're so, so cute. I mean, so dressy. I don't do super fancy, but you know what I mean. As always, thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't. Let me know any video requests down below and I'll see you guys next week. Bye.